Hello and welcome to another video. Today I'll be talking about the new MetaHuman demo that Unreal Engine have put out and just how to set up Live Link on an Apple device for that. Um, basically, there's a misconception in your iPhone 12. You don't need the LiDAR sensor. It's just the true depth sensor. So according to this, the iPad Pro first generation should do it. If I look on here, it says true depth camera. I've used an earlier iPad Pro for this. Um, so once you've done that, obviously you download Unreal and then you find the MetaHumans pack and download that. And that will put it in your vault. And here you can create a project. Make sure you've got version 4.26 installed. And once that happens, you can launch the project. We'll have to wait for it to download, obviously. So the next thing we want to do is to go and download the actual app. When we go in there, should track our face. Make sure you're facing the front camera. And we need to go into the settings here. We need to look for the uh, live link here. And in the target here, we put the IP address of our machine that we are going to send the messages to. So that'll be the machine that's gone real on it, obviously. You could have several. There's not much else we need to do here, really. It's that simple. Um, if you want to do the head rotation, you can turn this one on. And if you want the preview mesh on you and your motion capture, you can put that one on. That's the only options I've used here, really. So it should be ready to go. You hit this button here to go live and you can press the other one here just to record a take if you want to. So back into Unreal here and what we want to do is just go into Windows here live link and make sure that this is showing if you've got the IP address of your machine correctly this will show up as your iPad. Once that's there we can go into the main level blueprint when you first press play on this if you've played it for the first time you probably want to watch it with the film but if you don't want to do that you can go in here into the um, level blueprint and just disable this node here just before the play delay in the play montage so that will load the lighting in then compile save and then we can go into the actual blueprint for our actor here or meta human sorry and click that and you'll have a boolean here to enable you to do the head movement and you'll also have something here which you have to specify the name of your live link device so once you've done that compile save again and press play and that should be everything let's see and we'll just hit the live button we should be ready to go So that's that. So how to change the character. Basically behind this one, there may be an easier way to do this by the way, this is um, just the way I do it. So what I would do is just copy the location for this one here, just right click there, copy. And then if we go into this blueprint, we'll just hide it for a sec. So we can do that under under here actor hidden in game in rendering that should do it and also we can just hide it here and we find this other human 004 we can right click and paste the location of that one in and if we press play now we should get this one Okay, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, uh, send me a message, subscribe, look out for more videos. Cheers, thank you.